I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Dog. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> Bibbidi bobbidi boo. I'm carrying my girl to the zoo. Bibbidi bobbidi boo. Let's try to forget that giant black dick we just saw. Whoa, what? Excuse me? Uh, uh, <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. My, my friends. That's crazy. My friends enjoy texting fucking dick pictures to each other. Because. <laughs> so is that something that you expected? It, I, I did not expect it because my okay. friend is also looking to buy a car right now. Oh, which okay. is why he, like, disguised it in such a great way. <laughs> So like I get a group text from one one of my friends to another saying, oh, saying, yo, a buddy is selling a BMW N5, three three thousand miles in mint condition. He's selling it because he needs the money ASAP. I think you'll like it. The color is matte black, as shown in the photo. And then you open it up, and it's just a black dude with a huge dick, <laughs> just fucking gigantic. I'm, I'm talking like fucking like down to the knees, foot and a half. Yeah, at least. I feel incredibly inferior. I don't. Nice. <laughs> <laughs> Why would you feel inferior? Everybody's got a, a dick that big, right? Yeah, everyone's got dick dick down to knees, right? Is that <laughs> dick down to knees? Is that yeah. <laughs> Uh, D T T D D D T K, <laughs> right. And obviously, we've been saying that all our lives because it came so naturally. <laughs> I'm making her shine <laughs> with Aww. the light of a thousand suns. That's beautiful. I'm also making her blind. That's a what it feels bit. like to be in love. And if you look directly into love, it's like ah! <laughs> <laughs> Don't ah! I think I have permanent damage now. Yeah, my corneas. Um. Alright, right. so I got this. Now, oh, so I can use my, my shield and her shield now. Or her oh. fucking harp. Harp or whatever. How right. many times do I have to play the fucking command medley? I'm gonna seriously kill you. All of the many times. It, I think in the GameCube version it was like... Oh shit, I can't aim up? Oh shit. Oh, maybe I can just do it with my back to it? No. Hmm. Okay, so... Walk medley into one of the beams and reflect it into one of the statue's eyes. Right. Release control of medley so that she's still reflecting the light in the so into the eye. Then have Link stand... Oh, it says Link. Link stand in the other beam of light. Well, his name is Link. Oh. His name is Butler. <laughs> have Link stand in the other beam of light and reflect the light into the other statue's eye. When both eyes are illuminated, the fog dissipates. The room lights and a set of stairs leading down to the first floor of the basement appears. Oh, okay, uh, fine. Okay, fine. There you so go. if I do this and then I, because it, it like doesn't stay, I so think if it, I do this and then hit back. Oh, she'll just keep it there. Yep. Neat. I didn't, yep. Think, I didn't think that that would happen. Boom. I thought there was a workaround I had to do where like he gets into a pose where he stays there. Or yeah. Something. That's well, that's not your fault. That's this game fucking with us for forty episodes. Whoa! Don't say that out loud. Oh no! No! Oh well. You'll you'll get the the backlash of a thousand suns. No, the game. I mean, like, it's puzzles. It's puzzles to solve. That's what I mean by fucking with us. We're all so stupid. <laughs> like, don't don't you worry about that. Oh yeah, sure. I've got that covered for the both of us. No. Hey, I've been here every step of the way, being like, yeah, <laughs> I support you. <laughs> That's a good decision to walk in circles for an hour. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do it. <laughs> I'm getting bored. <laughs> Could you do something else? I'm just gonna walk in circles for another half hour. Sounds good! Yeah, that's another problem, because, like, I'm not easily bored the way I'm sure many normal people are, you know? So I'm like, yeah, we can just walk around. I'll just enjoy the, the backgrounds and the scenery and the colors. And wow, this game is very creative. Yeah, exactly. It'd be prettier if you were fucking doing something. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> <laughs> you know, people are losing their fucking minds. <laughs> And quite understandably so. Yeah! Nice! Shit! Fucking creepy ass skull. It's kind of unsettling when it's it gets very frozen. Unsettling. Yeah. Let me see if I can, like, snipe it out of this guy. Do it! Check this shit out. And, huh! Nope. <laughs> Just and fucking huh, nope. knock down the chains that hold up the bridge and that is our only way out of this dungeon. <laughs> yeah. Come on, man. And, huh! Oh man, I'm fucking horrible at this. Alright, All right, come here. Auto target. Oh shit, no! Oh. I fell in the fire! It's not even fire. The smog. Oh, there's wall masters down here. He's not a wall master, he's floor master. There's fucking, there's, yeah, there's not even a wall. 
Yeah, why is he called Wallmaster if, like, he comes from the ceiling? Yeah. That wasn't the way it was previously. What? The thing- time Well, I mean, like, he would float above you, like, near the ceiling, right? Mm, yeah. Well, I guess because he came out of the walls. Correct. Okay. That makes sense. But that was a different time. He was a much chunkier hand. Yeah. He was okay with the limited power he had over walls. <laughs> they always obeyed him because, I mean, you know. Yeah. Stay there! Now he's been working out a Good lot. work. He has very thin wrists. <laughs> yeah, that's true. <laughs> he's got thin wrists, like a, like a, uh, that movie Ray. Did you ever see the movie Ray? Like about Ray Charles? Yeah, with Jamie Fax. Mm, Jamie Fax. <laughs> no, I never have. Is he, it good? Yeah, it's pretty good. Okay. He he has a method of like since he's blind. Right. He has a method of uh, finding out if girls are hot or not. Uh huh. By the the like the thickness of their wrists. Oh, interesting. Yeah. I've never tried that. So if he's like flirting with a girl, he like he kind of like subtly grabs their their wrist. Well, when, but, but people with thin wrists can be down, super down ugly. To, right, left. Oh, it's the thing. Um, uh, I don't know. It's just it's just in the movie. Right. I've never done it. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> I can see. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he's blind. <laughs> Was blind. <laughs> He's dead! God rest his soul. God rest his soul. <laughs> I love Ray Charles. Did it? Didn't he do that superstition song? Uh. That, that is Stevie Wonder, I believe. Oh. Yeah. Oh. <laughs> I get my blind dudes mixed up. I, yes. I get my. That's horrible! I get my... I'm the worst person! No! No, you're not bad just because you get your black blind performers confused. <laughs> What's wrong with that? <laughs> Racist. <laughs> Citus. Uh, yes, yeah, Citus. <laughs> oh man. Anyway, yeah, I, I don't know any songs he wrote. <laughs> I'm sure I did. If I if it was like, oh, he wrote fucking the twist. No, he did a ton of shit. No, that was Chubby Checkers, God. I think. Sorry, you know how I am with black performers. <laughs> Come on, baby. Let do the twist. Oh, so awesome. Shoo, bop, bop. Come on, baby. You ever into uh, Herbie Hancock? Uh, yeah, every day in the bathroom. It's <laughs> <laughs> the only place I can get some privacy. <laughs> What's up, Herbie? <laughs> With my Hancock. Uh, he's fucking amazing. Is he? he? He's Is my... he like a recent guy? Or... No, he was a jazz dude uh, in the 70s. He basically created, um,. Modern funk music. If you ever listen to uh, an album called Headhunters by Herbie Hancock, like he has a song in there called Chameleon, which is like widely regarded as one of the original like funk songs of the 70s. How's it go? Do you want me to go on? It's like 20 minutes. Uh, at least 19 more. <laughs> it's so good. Because it's it's considered like one of the first funk songs because it used like slap bass and shit. It yeah, just just the the vibe of it was totally unlike anything it was that funky. It was yeah. Did they have the word funky before yeah. funk music? I don't know. Mm. Oh, you know what other song he did that's that's more well known, I guess? What? Uh, in the 80s. Uh, Rocket. It was a. Oh, yeah. The video of that. Have you ever seen the video of that? No. It's fucked. Is it really? It's so creepy. Jesus. Even even now it's creepy. It has kind of a creepy vibe to the song in general. Yeah, it's just like mannequins that are like, um... Oh, maybe I have seen that. Yeah, they're like walking around and they have like, I guess electrical puppet things going on. It's, and there's like a bird thing that's like... Mum, 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 mum. It's super creepy. Jesus Christ. Rocket by Herbie Hancock. Go find that shit, it's good. <laughs> Rocket by Herbie Hancock. And then enjoy your nightmares. <laughs> <laughs> What was that used in? Like oh, recently? All kinds of things. That, that is definitely like a commonly used song. Yeah, I'm sure it was in commercials or and stuff. What's that song that like everybody uses that drum and bass beat from? What's that? Like, 
that that one i don't know it's it's a super famous beat yeah but it's it's like from just an old record from like the 70s that everybody just reuses the sample of i have no idea so i need a key so i gotta go in one of these fucking doors and i gotta bring bitch with me hey what she prefers the term i don't know what a female duck is <laughs> i don't know like a duckette yeah duckette now that's a that's a that's a coin of some kind, isn't a, it? A ducat? A ducat? I believe so. Is that like a Persian currency? I, it, is it? I don't know. We're gonna study up on a bunch of things <laughs> next time on Game Grumps. All right, next time on Game Grumps, we find out what bucket is. No, ducat. Ducat. I know what a bucket is. Oh, it's like a pail. Oh, it's like it's about three dollars at Home Depot. <laughs> <laughs> nice. <laughs>